Okay, now the next letter is today. Um, nothing's happening with me. I feel like I'm standing still. Well, sometimes, you know, <laughs> do I know how that feels? Wait, yes, I do. Sometimes this is the way it is, you know. You're going to maybe have some things happen, but maybe it's just not time for that to happen yet. And as I've told you before, you're going to have a lot of confusion before you have enlightenment. And when you have that confusion, sometimes you have to be still. And you have to experience it until it gets sorted out here, and then it'll come here and you can figure it out. But let me put it to you this way. Let's just say that you're a vessel, okay, and we'll represent that with a glass, okay? And here we have a glass, and um, it's, you know, big old glass, let's say. <laughs> it takes a lot of fluid. Then we have maybe a pitcher, and the pitcher is full of nice, cool, clean, clean water. Alrighty, and we need this. We need it really bad. Well, let's just say the universe is filling that glass, that vessel, which is you, with the water or the energy that you need in order to make the next step. Now, maybe sometimes it's a tiny little old bathroom cup, you know, and it don't take nothing to fill it up overnight. And then sometimes it takes a long time. And maybe that's what's happening right now. Maybe that it's taken a long time to get that energy. Now, the reason you're stuck is because... Well, let's just say you're moving that glass around all over the place. It's going to be kind of hard to get that filled. You know, you're going to be spilling energy left and right. Maybe when you're pushing really, really hard, you don't realize that you're making it more difficult for this energy download or this water into this glass, you know, happen the way it needs to. So sometimes you have to be still. And it, if you're not still, maybe the universe sticks you down to be still so that this can happen. And I think that's what's happening. Here's the thing. It don't last forever. I hope <laughs> for both of us. And I think that eventually it's done. The energy's there. The confusion clears. The unstuckness gets done away with. And you can move on into the next chapter. But like I said, maybe if you did change things, if you did move on before it was time, before this vessel is filled, before things need to you know, happen for it's supposed to happen wouldn't be a good outcome. Perhaps it would be uh, uh, maybe not the best outcome, but it could even be a devastating outcome. You know, who knows? So, again, um, sometimes you have to trust your process, which is really, really hard. Sometimes the worst thing you can do is, you know, be patient and trust the process that you're going through, that maybe there's things going on that you're just not able to see right now, but perhaps you'll see in hindsight or maybe you'll see a result of later that will make things a little clearer. Maybe you won't understand it all. I don't know. But that's the best I can tell you for today.